Jazz beer reviews. Tui's extra dry. Okay, so reviewing Tui's extra dry. Now this beer is uh, five percent alcohol. It's uh, it's sold uh, over the east coast of Australia. It's uh, of course it's a dry beer, so it's uh, mostly sweetness being fermented out of it to uh, the more dry finish and less sweetness. All right, let's crack her open. Well, to be expected, it's got a lot of carbonation there for big fizz. Okay, I'm going to be using a uh, mini glass. This, be, uh, this glass holds 285 mils. So the colour's got uh, a pale golden colour to it, golden yellow. Um, geez, I've got plenty of head there, got about uh, at least two finger of head. And the smell. Picking up like adjunct uh, smells to it. But the smell of a bit of a bit of sweet malt to it. Okay. The taste. Cheers. It's got a very, uh, uh, it's a very uh, thin body to it. It's actually sweeter than I remember. Uh, it's got a strong bitterness to it for a uh, dry beer, for like the style. Um, starts very, uh, it, sweetness first up, and then you're getting a bitterness. So things around a little bit, but not that much. Uh, getting a lot of lacing on the glass there. Heaps of lacing. It's actually, it's alright. Full of price, you can get a carton of this for at least, uh, sometimes a special low as 32.80 to around 35. Um, they're actually I'm just reading, uh, Tui's Extra Dry and the Tui's Extra Dry Platinum, which is a high strength one, are coming down in uh, alcohol percentage uh, from X Tui's Extra Dry is coming down from 5 to about 4.6. And the Platinum, which I will review tomorrow, it's uh, it's 6.5%, which is like a, a malt liquor, I suppose, for all, uh, in the US. It's 6.5 and it's coming down to around 5.2. So it's coming down heaps. But um, but uh, this, this beer is alright. It's not too bad for the, uh, for the price. It's not overly... It's not, the dry finish is not as much as I remember. It's actually sweeter than I remember. But um, ah, it's alright and... Heaps of, once again, heaps of lacing, which is uh, very impressive. You really wouldn't expect it from that. Yeah. Um, I'm going to give it... It's all fantastic. Um, but it's okay. They have all these beers at uh, big big day festivals in Australia. Uh, races usually pretty popular. So uh, I'm going to give it a C+. Plus. It's, a, um, it's a decent beer. There's nothing wrong with it for a lager that's mass-produced. And uh, yeah, so two weeks extra dry. Righto, till next time, take care, and remember, no stress, have a beer. Cheers.